A. I'm Spook Matambo, a musician from Johannesburg, South Africa. And I'm visiting New York. This is my first American trip. Came to play some DJ shows, hang out. That's my first album, which is the big step, I guess. But I've been making music, and the, the following's been growing steadily in Europe for a while, you know. A few South Africans know what I do. More and more people in Europe have known. And now it feels like, okay, Americans are starting to pay attention. So it's cool. It's really rad. It's my first album, so I'm just excited about that. I've just started DJing, so I've been in America playing a couple DJ shows. I worked as a graphic designer as well. But um, yeah, I've been pretty lazy with that, so I need to get my weight up. I need to get my weight up. I listen to so much different stuff that it's always like shifting and changing, you know? But I mean, I guess keywords would be like um, UK based music, grime, South African Guaito, South African house, traditional South African Zulu Maskandi stuff, Afrobeat, you know, Fela Kuti, Prince, Iggy Pop, uh, a lot of metal I've started listening to. So, like, a lot of different sounds, yeah. And with the DJing, I'm moving more towards bringing that all together. Yeah, I've been writing some new stuff, just scheming because there are a couple of different ways to go about this. <laughs> so it's nice, yeah man. Working on the next one. Gonna get straight back into it. But also a lot of people haven't heard this one yet, so that's the thing. I don't want to be too much of the guy who's like, oh new stuff, new stuff, because no one's heard this stuff. So we're still gonna do probably a year of touring this music, but all the while writing and recording new stuff. And hopefully the next one will drop about the same time or earlier, you know, next year. The band is me, Richard III and Jacob on drums. He also produced some of the stuff. And Richard on kind of synth machines and samplers. But now I want to get a guitarist in to play, you know, another sound. And not like soaring guitars, but there's this, um, there's a style of South African guitar playing, like Maskandi musicians. It's kind of circular blues funky stuff so I want to bring that in and see what happens I guess a lot of the people that grew up not like were born in but that grew up in LA in the 70s and 80s they have like a real um, calm cool down-to-earthness about them like I met like some real solid people but also for me it's a, to meet a lot of my heroes you know like the party that I played at low in theory is promoted by daddy Kev and that's dude I used to listen to in high school so that's pretty exciting. And then out here, played with the gang gang dance last night. So that part of the thing is really exciting, just to come across people that I respect and then to get busy, you know? But on the flip side, I'm excited about how culturally diverse New York is. For me, it's like um, the city in Blade Runner, you know? Where it's like the whole world meets there. And that's really cool. That's really exciting. Right now, my mind is just blown by the scale of stuff, you know? It's so big and long and it's such a huge city and uh, went to Times Square last night kind of tipsy, a little bit tipsy from the party, but went to Times Square at like four in the morning and all those lights just kind of freaked my brain out. The first single Machine One came out and we had a ton of remixes for that, but for this new one it's pretty, we've made pretty exciting links. Um, the new single is called Don't Mean To Be Rude and uh, Scratch a DVA from London, a guy on who releases on Hyperdub and he DJs on Rinch FM. He supported the one song Let Let Them Talk, so we asked him to remix this one and he's down. Also, um, the dude's totally crossed out on Mad Decent, they're gonna do a remix and I hung out with them in LA and the Toads are the best guys. When I think of them I get like a little warm, a warm sparkly feeling in my heart. No homo. No, yes homo, I love those guys. And um, they're gonna do a remix. And maybe, and Don Rimini from France, who's like really, really super into his music. So it's gonna be a smaller remix package than the last one, which was kind of overblown. You know, I asked everyone I know, and all of them delivered really big things that, so I had to release everything, and it was like 14 remixes, a big package. This one's gonna be three.